Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with another Tinkercad Tuesday Designer Showcase. So, my friends, let's get cracking. All right, friends. So, today I'm going to showcase another one of my students, but I'm also going to showcase one of my designs. I have got a simple little project, less than nine minutes, and it creates an awesome balloon and uses the duplicate technique to show you how to make the balloon pieces in a snap. I just used it with my class yesterday, and the results were splendid. Uh, so much fun, and the kids took this and integrated it with the pixeler lesson so they added it to background so it was just a ton of fun and it was a great way to start our school day so this was the original lesson where I actually built it uh, each piece was a solid if you look underneath it does not actually work as a balloon it was just fun and it gave them the skills of duplicating and rotating the project I'm showing you is by Lucius and Lucius not only did my project he took the time to come up with the idea to hollow it out. He took the design, put a second one inside it, and cut it out. If we click on the transparent, it is so cool to see inside where he put the second one. He used shift scale to shrink it, then simply made the second one a hole and grouped it. Let's shut off that transparency, and then we can simply hit ungroup to take a look at how he cut it and then he sliced it again so that it was flat. I'm gonna undo what I just did so it goes back together. So the Squidward was not created. That's a copy from another designer, which once again, you can find on designers profiles. If you're looking for the profile of Lucius, I will put the link in the description of the video. He only has this one at this time, but if you like it, you can give him a like. He is actually allowing derivatives, so you can hit copy and tinker as well. If you click the view in 3D button, After a bit of a wait, you get to actually check out his design in 3D. Notice that transparent part does not show up transparent in this kind of view. Lastly, friends, make sure you check out the Facebook group Tinkering with Tinkercad. I'd love to see this get to 2,000 users soon. Make sure you also visit the Tinkercad Worldwide User Group. And last but not least, you can check out that subreddit, Tinkercad, on Reddit. Also, friends, please remember, if you ever make something awesome, you can share it with me by hitting that send to button, scrolling down, and inviting people. When you generate a link and copy that link, you can then put it on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter so that I can check it out, or you can send it to me on Gmail, and they are all at HLModTech. Who knows, you make something awesome and share it with me, you could be the next person featured on the Tinkercad Designer Showcase. Friends, of course, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.